Okay. What's good, man? It's your boy Q Tuck, Shoe Game Elite. And uh, this is a collection update video. The last time I did a video on my collection, it was November. And uh, some of the shoes that was in that video, uh, I left out. There was no need to put them in there. Uh, see, I got a couple more shoes down there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a pair of Griffey's, a pair of Air Max's, some other stuff. You know, that's my girl's. Some of her shoes. Well, that's all her tennis shoes, her sandals, and more and more. But these are the main shoes right here. Now, this video is strictly for, you know what I'm saying, a collection update. Uh... I just want to show some shoes that I bought since then. Since the last video, I remember which ones I bought. I know I did reviews on a bunch of these shoes, but uh, I never did a collection update with them. And uh, keep in mind that these are just some of the shoes. I got more shoes uh, elsewhere. At my auntie house in Houston, got about three, four pair of forces and a couple pair of J's, six rings, got bunch of forces and deals at my room at my mom's house but yeah we finna just show these shoes right quick so first what we're gonna do we're gonna show the diamond turf collection okay I'm a big diamond turf head I love Deion Sanders I love the shoe these are my first ones you seen in the first video I was like well, I'm gonna get some more diamond turfs man bet that and I got four more pair since then since November these are the Ravens got these I think these was the very next pair I bought I was in search of those and ended up with these I wore these a couple times, like three times. Wore these about four or five times. Uh, I was going to buy those Cowboys ones, the white and blue ones, and ended up getting my fresh ones, which I was really in dire need for. The DS have worn me at dead stock. And uh, my girl got me these for Valentine's Day, the Cowboy ones. These are all my size, all size 12. These are all the diamond turfs that dropped. For that retro, anyway. Next, we're going to go to Air Max 95. I just did a video on these. Wore these once for like two hours. And then I picked up these when the Seaman Forge dropped. I'm getting my Air Max game book. I told uh, I told y'all in the video, I saw them them gray and red ones that was all beat up. I said I'm gonna get some more Air Maxes, but these are the only two Air Maxes that I just felt like was worth copping. That vote on there, that extra red, them two live ass Air Maxes. Uh, here we got last shot 14s. Wore these, I think three or four times. That's about it. I don't really care for them that much. I wear them a lot if I feel like it. They may some of them say, nah, I ain't gonna wear them. I'll, these are always an option because, you know, they really ain't just a holy grail type shoe, so I'll keep safe. Got my Space Jams here. That's yellow one on the bottom. That dropped like two years ago. Y'all saw that in the last video. Here I got my uh, Concourse Dead Stock. Still have them worn. Probably not going to wear them. You know, you got that funny looking toe right there, man. Y'all know y'all talking about that clear toe, the milky toe. And these are from Foot Locker. So I don't, y'all can say what y'all want to say about that. You know what I'm saying? Still got the stick on the box. They dead stock. Still have them worn yet. Probably not going to wear them. Got my low top 11s. I wear these often. It's been a while since I worn them, though, because I haven't cleaned them up. But, uh, it's a comfortable shoe. I love this shoe. Seaman Forest that just dropped. If you saw that video that I just put, I had copped a second pair. And uh, shout out to the person that bought them on eBay. It's a cool dude. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all just something I wanted to try. And it worked out very well. I mean, as far as the shoe go, I've tried it on. I went ahead and tried it on. I didn't really like how it fit, how it looked, but... 
you know, whatever, just something to add to the collection and have a pair of fours. So there you go. Uh, cement threes, black cement threes. What these once? I wore them to Austin. Went to the mall and shit in them. Wore them once. They still laced up. And uh, they got a from walking in them. They got a nice little crease. And they, these shoes already come pre-crease. How they how they stitched and designed. They got a little crease right there already before you wear them. I stitched, but I put a nice little crease in them from wearing them that one time. Haven't worn since, and that was like early, early January, maybe December. Black flip threes, dead stock, still haven't worn. I don't know if I if I'm wear them. I was thinking about putting them on eBay, but they not really selling on eBay like that. They still got a few pairs, probably still in the stores. They ain't sell like I thought they was going to sell, but I still got my pair. they stock, size 12. Everything here is size 12, except my space rims. Y'all probably already know the story on that if you watch my last videos. Uh, for the love of the game, Olympic 7s. These are supposed to drop again in June or July, but they're not going to be the love for the game. They're going to be the retro. OG pair without the stitching right there, and I'm probably gonna get them. I don't even wear these anymore. I was gonna do a cleanup video on them because I was cleaning and restoring the bottom. Took it had gum on the bottom with cigarette stuck in it, and I ended up getting it out. But uh, since then, I haven't touched them. Tried bleaching the shoestring, I didn't work too well. Uh. Black fives that dropped with the 3M on the tongue. I kind of retired these. When I, when I say retire, I don't mean they beat up and put them. I kind of like stopped wearing them to reserve them, preserve them a little bit better. No, but I, I like this shoe a lot. I love fives. Then I got my Grey Wolf fives. These I really kind of retired because uh, I don't know, I just love this shoe so much. I like this shoe. Wish I had to bring in the LS fives that came out, the lifestyle fives. My big cousin Joker got them. Wish I could get them. He got them off of Picky Shoes. Dot com. Uh, Old Royal Tens that just dropped a couple weeks ago. Dead stock. Haven't worn them yet. I'm not too big on this shoe. If time comes, I will wear it. I bought it because I needed a blue shoe. And uh, I got these when they dropped. Then I ended up getting them blue diamond turfs. So they're my two blue shoes right there. So yeah, that's about it. I was thinking about the true blues when they dropped, but the money wasn't right. and wasn't, wasn't really worried about them. So oh well. Yeah, but they did stop. Chicago tens. I wore them once for a couple of hours. Went to a little step show. And these, that's it. Got a little bit of a crease on them, slight crease. I actually take steps when I walk. I don't do that bullshit as duck walking, penguin walking, because I don't want to crease my shoes. I actually walk. And, uh, let's see. Playoff 13s. I don't really wear these that much because they crease easily. You see that? When I put my foot in them, that crease go away, but they crease easy. I like this shoe a lot. It's just they crease easy. And I barely wear those. Uh, flu game twelves. I just wore these recently the other day. They need to be cleaned up. They look ashy. I don't know. This red part just got real ashy, like I was stepping in dust, but I wasn't. But yeah, I can clean them up real nice. I retired these. Black and Carolina blue, twelves. I retired and I don't really wear them that much, cause uh, they started getting kind of wore down. I can't wait for the playoff twelves to drop. The playoff twelves, they gonna be a beast. Where this is my collection update as of February twenty third, two thousand twelve, and uh, y'all submit. I mean, uh, my fault. Subscribe, comment, let me know what y'all think. Like us on Facebook, Shoe Game Elite. I'm out here.